So I want to read you this great tip that was posted by a Long Long Honeymoon subscriber, Mr. Mark, 85044, who writes, very important, a 3000 watt generator will power your AC, but you must do a few things before you try it. When you power up your generator and connect it to your trailer, a few things are going to happen. Your power system will attempt to charge your house batteries. That alone may take over 1000 watts of power. Another thing that will happen is if you have your fridge in the auto mode, the fridge will start using power from your generator. That will also take about 500 watts from your generator. This will not leave enough power to run your air conditioner. You need to shut off the circuit breaker for your power converter and move your fridge switch to the gas only position. This should let all of your power from your generator run your air conditioner. And I replied, thanks for your posts, Mr. Mark. This is great advice, and indeed it is. I don't wanna to get too bogged down in numbers and details. Here's the deal. If you have a 3000 watt or below generator and you're trying to power your RV air conditioner, it is very important that you check your refrigerator, toggle it from AC current to propane, because that's gonna free up about 500 watts of power from your generator. The other step you may need to take is to go to your circuit breaker box and flip the switch for the power converter for the RV. Now, of course, whatever RV you own, you may need to check the owner's manual to make sure you flip the right switch. It's not a big deal. This can be done in about 15 seconds and it will free up your generator to power what you really want it to power your air conditioner. So that's it guys, just a quick tip. Thanks again, Mr. Mark, for posting such a great comment on one of our videos. Until next time, if you're new here, please subscribe to our channel for more tips and videos about our travels with our Airstream. As always guys, safe travels, happy camping, and lolo ho. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you disliked it, give it a thumbs down. Feel free to leave a comment. And of course, don't forget to subscribe.